The trip to Colombia has been an eye-opener. We were so pleasantly surprised. The people are wonderful, the sights are terrific, and just seeing the lush, velvety greens and the trees, it's spectacular. Before, you know that we have some hard times, and that is like the black history of Colombia. But when you come here to Colombia and you realize that Colombia is a wonderful place, it's really safe. The only risk is wanting to stay. Our Gate 1 tour in Colombia begins in the capital city of Bogotá. It's a great place to introduce the Colombian traditions. Then we fly to the coffee region, which is Manizales, where you can get one of the best coffees of the world. Then we go to Medellín, the beautiful city in our country. Finally, we go to Cartagena, where you can see the Caribbean coast, the historical city. And with this tour, we can cover everything about my beautiful country. Colombia! Bogotá is uh, such a vibrant city. You have a mix of the old and, and the new. Uh, you see people out and about. In Bogotá, we go to what we call the old city. Uh, walk around some historical places there, the main square, a couple of museums, the beautiful Botero Museum and the amazing Gold Museum. This beautiful Gold Museum with the most of these kinds of pieces in the world. So we're here playing Tejo in Bogota, Colombia, and it's awesome, it's exciting. So you get like this big bomb and you just like throw it and you try to hit in the middle. And then that happens if you hit in the middle, but it's exciting, it's fun, it's a good sport. One of the side trips we made was to the Salt Cathedral from Bogota. It's just beautiful, very artistic. Bienvenidos a la zona cafetera de Colombia. In the Cocora Valley, we had a hike around all of the beautiful area of the valley to see all of the wax palm tree, that is the tallest palm tree in the world. This palm tree is in danger. That's why Gate One, they have a really good program and is planting a tree, which is really meaningful for us since there is not going there to enjoy that area, but also they're going to help us that our next generation, they can enjoy also that place. Today at the coffee plantation, I really felt I learned a huge amount the walk through the plantation with the owner of the plantation was spectacular. We had to talk to him directly, ask him questions. In the coffee farms, you can pick coffee, you can realize about the coffee process. So now, when you're going to drink a cup of coffee, you're going to think about the workers that did a really hard job to have this cup of coffee in your hands. We are in Medellin, uh, Botero Square, very neat. Definitely very interesting art, very eclectic, very unique. Definitely glad I got to kind of get to know Botero on this trip. But also in the city of Medellin, we are going to see all of the social transformation. And we are going to see why Medellin was chosen from the 220 cities as the most innovative cities in the world. We finally ended up in Cartagena, and that's been by far my favorite. It's awesome, it's very tropical, which is what I like. Cartagena is a colorful city full of life and history, and everywhere you go, you can find a side of the colonial story. You get to feel a peace all around, and you can sit down and enjoy people walking, and you can enjoy the sweetness of doing nothing. You can relax. Something really special about the program we have here in Colombia is the visit to the school. Gate One is the only tourism company that is going to this place and they get to support the families through the education and the food they give them. It was very moving. It was very moving to see those children and to think about the possibilities for them. Very moving. Yeah, brought, brought many of us to tears. People of Colombia, they are the best. They are really friendly, they, they always answer with a big smile, and they try to help you in whatever you need. The food is fantastic. Everything here I've noticed about the food, everything's really fresh. We have every kind of variety, so we can find fresh fruits because we have more than 100 kind of fruits. You find whatever you want to eat here, it's the best. We eat a lot. Here we don't get like personal portions, like small, no. We have a big one, and the more you get, the better you feel. 
Whatever it is, it's refreshing. That's really good. <laughs> it's hot. It's hot. It's hot. And the rum goes straight into your blood. I am feel really proud to be a guide because with this job I can show the beauty of my country. And you get the chance to change the image that they got about Colombia outside. Gate one! This is our ninth gate one trip. We like the size of the groups. We like the guides very much. The, the guides clearly love their countries. <laughs> Excellent, Colombia. <laughs> gate one has vetted these guides very, very well. They're not only knowledgeable, they obviously have a good time doing what they're doing. I have done six uh, trips with Gate One. I know I'm always going to get good value for my money. Yeah, I think that Gate One puts us into very nice accommodations, gets very good local guides, and is excellent with our transportation. Yeah, it's very good value. We'd, we'd recommend any Gate One trip. Really, they've. Uh, They've all been, they've all been good. People ask us, you know, well, what's your favorite trip? And, uh, yeah, they're all good. And the people we've met I could not have been nicer. I'm talking about the other people on the trip. What I like about this trip is that there are different ages, people from various areas. Everybody is very friendly. I feel absolutely safe here. So I think once they get across the fact that it's a safe place to visit, then tourists will increase. So I think the future is very bright for this country. I invite you to come to my country, to my beautiful country, Colombia. Mi casa es su casa. You are more than welcome to visit us. Bye. <laughs>